Hi everyone, it's Sweetwater Pearl, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how I do crochet. Um, I'm going to be using a size J hook, which is a 10 or a 6.00 millimeters. What you want to do is create a slip knot. If you do not know how to make a slip knot, I suggest that you go to my video that shows you how to uh, make a slip knot. So you want to make your slip knot and I'm going to show you how to um, chain in this video. You wrap the working yarn around the hook and you want to pull it through your slip knot loop and you have made one chain. Again you wrap it around your hook, you slip it through, and you have created two chains. If you can see, this is considered one chain and this is considered two chain, the second chain. Again, wrap the uh, yarn around the hook, pull it through the loop. Um, you don't have to use the J hook, but the reason why I'm using the J hook is so that you have um, a cl more clear view of what is going on. You wrap around, pull it through. I'm going to turn it sideways so you can see. I'm wrapping it around. I turned it and I'm pulling it through that loop. You can see they look like a braid or like hearts. So you have one heart, two, three, four five, six hearts. That's how um, you create a chain which is your base foundation. It's necessary to have the chain foundation when you start crocheting. See? Put the yarn around the hook, hug the yarn with your hook, and I like to turn it sideways a little bit just um, so that I'm sure that uh, that the yarn that I grabbed onto doesn't um, come off. Like if I go like this, there's a possibility and um, if you're a beginner it's a great chance that you uh, that the yarn will come off see like that so I like to be on the safe side and turn the hook to face down again wrap the yarn around the hook pull it through the loop you want to make sure also that your tension is not so tight Because the tighter your tension is, um, the tighter your stitches will be. When I wrap for my tension, I usually either wrap it once around my pinky and then my index finger, or just my index, depending on um, what I'm working on, and it depends on how much tension I want controlled. Usually when you have it wrapped around the pinky, you have more control over the tension. Again, wrap around, pull it through, wrap around, pull it through. Sometimes I like to hold it here because um, this can come off and it happens very often with everyone even the most experienced person it happens to
again wrap pull through I'm going to position it in a different angle so you can see. Sometimes I think it's it's um, good to show in a different angle sort of what you're doing. And you just want to continue doing the same. Um, if you're a beginner to crochet, I suggest that you start um, working with chains, building up a chain foundation, and uh, that's how you get started. Thank you all for watching.